Hi, I'm magician Matt DeSero, and I'm here in Markham, Ontario at the Markham Energy Storage Facility. This is North America's first major power to gas energy storage facility. It's a joint venture between Enbridge and Hydrogenics. Hey David, I'm going to show you something kind of cool here, a bit of a magic trick before we get to talking about things. I've been traveling and um, I got some paper money here from a foreign country. When you got plastic money, you know you always want to fold it into origami shapes or you want to maybe puncture it to see what it'll do, make it float. Um, but I like to do, with my currency, I like to take things and actually make things penetrate solid through solid which is kind of cool, it is a cool trick. I know, now what I showed you is like kind of astounding, but truthfully, to be honest with you, I'm more astounded by what you guys do here. So I was wondering if you might tell me a little bit about what's going on. So Matthew, we're here at Enbridge Gases facilities in Markham, Ontario. This is the home of North America's first power to gas energy storage facility at a utility scale. Uh, first and foremost, this is a facility that helps provide grid stability services to the power grid while integrating more renewable electricity like solar and wind power. But at the same time, we're producing renewable and low carbon hydrogen that can be sent to the transportation fuel markets, fuel cell electric vehicles, cars, buses, trains. But what I'm most excited about is the opportunity to inject green energy into the natural gas pipeline system and increase the renewable content. Now we can decarbonize our home heating and are in commercial industrial markets for natural gas. So why is this needed? Well, what's interesting is power to gas energy storage technologies are very fast and very accurate at providing grid stability services. So when you look at this, if we can be faster and more accurate, we may actually require less of that service and that could save energy consumers money on their bills if we can use what's already existing. There's something really proud about a Canadian company leveraging Canadian world-class technology. Could you speak a little bit about that? You know, Canada has some excellent clean tech energy companies. We help them develop the technology. We even help them demonstrate it. So the collaboration between Enbridge and Hydrogenics, we think, has really opened up an opportunity to demonstrate how power to gas can solve Canada's unique energy challenges, be it in the electricity sector, transportation fuels, or the natural gas pipeline grid. So at the end of the day, if we can demonstrate how to use this in our own backyard, uh, Enbridge will benefit by being able to demonstrate to our consumers that we're able to deliver renewable energy that they want and need, but at an affordable price. So David, with the success of uh, this project, where do you see the future of energy? Well, at the end of the day, we believe that Power to Gas offers an opportunity for greater consumer choice. If consumers can obtain this renewable energy through the electricity grids, the natural gas pipeline networks, and the transportation fuel sector, that consumer choice should help drive down the cost of renewable energy. That's a good thing all around. So how's it been working with Hydrogenics? The opportunity with Hydrogenics and Enbridge working together was we established a joint venture company to build, own, and operate the first power to gas energy storage facility in North America. The strength of the two companies have really made that a success. In the case of Hydrogenics, their expertise in hydrogen technologies and their entrepreneurial spirit has really been instrumental in making this first-of-a-kind project real. Hydrogenics, the name companies around the globe rely on for some of the most innovative solutions. Check out our other videos of Hydrogenics technology. <laughs>